Well, we're 11 days away from the Boston Marathon, and it's always personal for each and every runner. But for one local father, there is no cause closer to his heart. It was last year we first introduced you to Scott Middlemas. He created the Joseph Middlemas Big Heart Foundation, named for the young son he and his wife lost to cardiomyopathy. Scott is running Boston again this year, and as Kate Merrill shows us, this year he has some new inspiration. Mwah. Who loves you? Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> what about me? Mama. Yeah. Two-year-old Jack Middlemas is the heart of his family, and it is clear he is also the soul. Just check out his whip and Nene. His seven-month-old sister What's Gracie cannot get enough. You like me, Nene? <laughs> Despite his big smile and even bigger personality, this small boy is facing a huge battle. He needs a new heart. He has hypertrophic cardiomyopathy and is waiting for a transplant. His older brother, Joseph, died at the age of six from cardiomyopathy when Jack was just a month old. I was obviously in a not a good place, um, as in um, a funk. And, you know, everyone, including my doctors, was saying, you have to do something active. You have to do something you know, to get your mind right. After losing Joseph, his family could have given up, but his parents wanted his death to mean something, so they started the Joseph Middlemas Big Heart Foundation, where the motto is, all you need is love. It gives us an outlet, I think, of hope. It allows us to carry on not only our son's um, memory, but everything, his legacy, what he taught us. And for the second year in a row, Scott Middlemiss is running the Boston Marathon for his foundation. But Jack knows the real inspiration. Who does Daddy run for? Me. Yeah, and you. And who else? And JoJo. And JoJo, yeah. And what do you say when Daddy runs? Go, Dad, along. Go stretch your other leg. Now Scott has his very first team member, Laura Ray Hokinson. She just had to support the mission. The pay it forward mentality that is behind the Big Heart Foundation, I think, is really what this world needs more of. They run for the foundation's simple goals of spreading kindness, music scholarship for kids, and supporting other cardiomyopathy families in the hospital. An inspirational cause for a man who now seems to find hope everywhere he looks, especially along the course. It's so inspiring to meet some of you know some of the people, and I think that's what I'm looking forward to again. Kate Merrill, WBZ News. Me. Nice finish. <laughs> And while both boys have the same disease, Sister Grace does not. Her heart is actually healthy. WBC is the only place where you can see wire-to-wire -wire coverage of the 2016 Boston Marathon. You can join us on Monday, April the 18th for all the action. Of course, we'll have all the interviews with the big winners of the day. And then, of course, we'll bring you the stories, the interviews with people like Scott, who are running it for such uh, emotional reasons. It's tremendous. Mm.